Hello everyone, it's Tony. So a dance practice that I've been actually very much looking forward to has just been released. This being for Hoshi's first mixtape song titled Spider. I am super excited for this because if you haven't seen out the music video already, yet, it's very kind of like almost came in move style ask very kind of just dramatic very kind of like swaggy very kind of cool very suave and i really enjoyed it especially with the bars in particular i was going to see i was looking forward to seeing how the performance of this how the choreography kind of ties into this with the full kind of like utilization of this actual tool or like uh i guess you could say prop as it is it's going to be really cool and i haven't seen a performance of it yet because i've been waiting for this so hopefully you guys are excited for as i am for this and if you want to go check out my music video reaction to it or any other 17 reaction that i have actually uh 17's the 8 is coming with a solo as well so hopefully you do stay tuned for that but yeah anything and everything 17 can be found in the 17 playlist down in the description box below hopefully you check out a video but with that being said let's not waste any more time and let's get into this video let's go Okay, so he's actually really hanging like it from in the teaser. Wow. He's strike. Oh, somebody else. Somebody else. <laughs> How his face isn't all red already from Blood Rush? I don't understand, man. Somebody yes. Oh, I just realized. Are they in the... I think he's in the Hybe Entertainment. The Hybe label uh, dance practice room. Interesting. Oh, oh, that's actually really difficult. Like, it's really hard on your shoulders doing that back thing right there. Like, what he did it here. Grabbing and going backwards like this. That's actually really strenuous on the back shoulders. Oh, he came in with the energy, the fierceness. Wow. I like the camera angles too because he's kind of like giving us a better view of him hoshi even though because like the guys are kind of like almost in a way blocking so i like how we're getting a better like view on how he is actually like presenting his facial features in particular because i think that the performance here really like kind of depends also on like how that person individual is selling the look of it and i think he really sells it really well kind of like that fierce but also cool type of vibe <laughs> Yeah. Oh, I love this part. This part is like this part in particular with the boom, like the dude. It's so nice. It's so smooth and so slow, but like every move is so precise. It's so smooth. And then he'll like go like that, like he'll go slow and they'll power, power. Oh, that's a little bit of like. Oh, interesting. So when he does like the, like you can see that you can hear in the background of the song, there's like kind of like breathing. Like I hadn't noticed that. There's a lot of popping. Very good dancer, by the way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, that's a really nice camera angle. This is also very difficult because you're relying on the weight of the other person to like keep you up and the balancing, even though like he's not at a 90 degrees, it's actually a lot harder. And then pick yourself up with body, pure, and then to pick yourself up with just pure body, like, look, this is very difficult. Oh, the high notes. Oh yeah, I'm not I'm not really like talking about the song because we had looked in the song in the music video already, so I'm just more like looking at the dancing. That's uh that's why I, I'm not like, like oh the the, the high notes because like we already saw that we like I have actually listened to the song like the entirety of this week, so yeah. <laughs> I like his footwork right here. It looked like he was moving forward, but he's actually staying in place. It's really smooth. Ooh. Ooh. I 
I'm really enjoying the camera angle work. Like it's it's evident they're using like a camera arm or like some form of gimbal to keep it stabilized throughout. But the way that it's moving in like one continuous take is very nice. Like here, they go in and they go like around like this. This is a better view of the angle. Oh, that is such a nice camera angle because I was curious as how they were gonna do that from the music video. Like he gets pulled and I really like this angle. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. I like how his head hits. And then let the camera go slower. The camera work really makes a big difference in this performance too. See, that's actually a quite an intensive choreography because if you look at in the back of his shirt beforehand, there wasn't this sweat stain, which he only had, he didn't have any at the beginning. So it's a very intensive choreography, but he makes it look so simple, so easy. I love this camera goes. Oh, look at that pop it. Boom. He, he definitely invokes some like Taman vibes here. I'm not gonna lie. I like how he's popping and dancing. And I know that he's kind of like a, a, a big, he's a big fan of Taman. So, ooh, the roll though. Ooh, ooh, okay. I like how they've used the kind of like the bars as like barriers almost it's like a good incorporation they're not just there and then they leave i like how they use them throughout yeah 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 yeah, yeah. really nice honestly i wasn't sure what to expect from this i was expecting maybe like they'd only do like one or two angles for the actual dance but they really surprised me and they did like multiple angles they kind of did like an actual performance video and it was really nice honestly i love the uh, the idea of the video the camera being what it really should be because here in this case i think that a lot of like the isolations with that the camera does by blocking out certain views and then like panning in really does itself a favor to the the performance because then you get like a better idea like this these effects like when he gets being pulled in particular that effect of him the camera going forward as well really sets it like makes it feel kind of a little bit more like cooler kind of like he's actually being dragged into a tunnel or uh like somewhere um i love the idea the incorporation of the bars also not just having him hang but also afterwards using the bars kind of like as that like main setting that main area that they'll go with but then still also using like the floor and the open space as like an actual setting also for like some dance parts as well very nice again i still find that he does have like a similarity to tame in with the move era or like say yeah particular move and i do know that he did he has mentioned that like tame is one of his bigger inspirations for like dancing and everything and you can see that kind of like i think influence here in how he's dancing and how he's like approaching it because this is kind of like a similar kind of like suave sexy type of darker vibe and i love how he kind of like reimagines that concept a bit to his own kind of flavor and own type of vibe very cool very nice i'm looking forward to seeing what more comes back from 17 the 8 is probably the next one that is going to be in line so i'm really excited for it i'm really excited to slowly but surely learn all these 17 members and hopefully you guys do stay tuned for the journey so with that being said thank you so much for watching if you want to go check out any of my other 17 reactions you can find them all in the 17 plays down description below hopefully you check out the video but with that being said guys thank you so much for watching i'm slumming down and as always if you have any comments questions or something you want to talk feel free to leave it in the comment section below and i'll get to you as soon as possible with that being said guys this has been tony and you can say goodbye and i'll see you in the next video and